Ever since Google introduced the Google Home smart speaker several years ago, it's been trying to get into the smart home. Here we are in San Francisco where Google has set up a smart home demonstration to show off some new features and show just how far Google Assistant has come. Throughout 2018, Google has really been pushing the smart home angle at consumers. It's been partnering with third-party manufacturers and setting up experiences like this to really drive home the message that Google Assistant is not just for your phone, but for every facet of your life. One of the new features is the addition of reply back functionality to broadcast. That means that whenever someone broadcasts from a phone to your smart home device, you can just tap a button or respond using Google Assistant. You can then have a back and forth conversation with the smart home device and the phone using broadcast. On the phone, you will see a link to the recording as well as a transcription of the text. One of the key features of Google's smart display is step-by-step -step recipes. Now Google has introduced recipe recommendations. Simply swipe right from the home screen to see them. The recipes are recommended to you based on your personal preferences, as well as the time of year and whether you want breakfast, lunch, or dinner. For example, during Thanksgiving, it will show you recommended Thanksgiving recipes. But the day after, however, it will show you recipes for Thanksgiving leftovers. Last but not least, you can actually save a recipe for later to create your very own cookbook. Google is partnering with Nickelodeon to add a little bit more family-friendly content to the Google Assistant. One example is uh, you can actually wake up to an alarm from the Ninja Turtles, for example. So you could say, hey Google, set a Ninja Turtle alarm. Other upcoming content partners include Lego as well as Hatchimals. There are also 25 new titles in storytime mode from partners such as Dora the Explorer as well as Paw Patrol. And the idea is that you ask Google Assistant to tell you a story and it will tell you stories from those particular content partners. Another new feature is Read Along where you can read a book alongside the Google Assistant. The Google Assistant will add music and little special effects to add a little bit of a panache to the story. Um, the most recent story is actually a new book called Eras the Star Engineer, it's actually written by a Google engineer. As far as the bedroom goes, Google has introduced a couple of new features that would make going to bed a little easier. One of them is that you can actually set your phone on silent by talking to a Google Home device. Hey Google, put my Pixel 3 on silent. Secondly, there is a new alarm called the Google Assistant Routine, which when you turn off the alarm, it'll set off a whole routine for you. For example, you can have it so that when you dismiss the alarm, it'll tell you the weather and turn on the coffee maker. Google is definitely going up against Amazon, here, which has had a head start. But Google's ubiquity in everyday devices definitely levels the playing field.